Okay, going to start off by saying I failed, and we'll get back to that in a minute, but uh, I wanted to get to the Ikea story that before I forget it. So I went to Ikea to buy my furniture very specifically for one corner desk, and it arrived damaged out of everything that was the only piece that was. And it had this big old dent on the inside of the packaging. So no outward signs of it. And it was like in the middle of all the pieces. So me and a friend drive down to Ikea to get it replaced. We go through everything and we get there. And we grab the packages. One of them was damaged. We noticed that. And we look inside, and it's the wrong color. Whoops, we grabbed half of it was white, half of it was black. So we go back inside, and we get that one exchanged for a white one. We get back outside. We notice that the other one is labeled white, so it's correct. But when we open both the packages... The white one was labeled black, so we had half black, half white for the desk. And this whole thing took hours. Like, it takes an hour and a half to drive down there. Who knows how many hours in store, and we end up with both pieces labeled white, but one's black and one's white. So now I have a half black, half white desk, and that was not the only bump in the road for moving. I'm still not fully unpacked. When did I move? Two months ago? Three months ago? It has been super stressful. I feel like I'm busy all the time and I feel constantly behind and not like I'm doing everything that I should and I'm pretty exhausted. Now going to, back to that part where I failed, I forgot. When I said, oh, I'm only going to get, like, one thing a week or one big thing as a treat, I forgot it was Halloween. Like, end of September, you would think, oh, I know myself well enough to know that is not going to work in October. It never works in October because it's Halloween. Half of my class, half of my house is probably... Super cute, and then there's this random skull somewhere from Halloween decorations. And my cat is playing with something. I'm going to go see what she's doing before she destroys something. Boop. You're getting into something. I'm not sure what. Huh? Kiki kitty. I'm surprised you're not meowing at me. He'll totally admit I ended up getting these. They're so cute. They're so cute. Look at them. Look at it. Look at it. It's a face. It's a face for a kitty. Another thing about October that I am super bad about is the nail polish. Uh, what is it? Pure Ice. It's one of my all-time favorites. And they always, always always come out with a bunch of limited edition ones for Halloween. And yes, I bought like eight bottles of nail polish. No regrets. None, none whatsoever. Not, not at all. And uh, me also being totally tempted by dollar store stuff. I got these little puzzle games because it was my friend's birthday and I think he will like them when I give him his presents whenever he shows up. Because he's an asshole who hasn't visited me. But anyway, I got two of those specifically for a friend. I feared that would be a good little addition to whatever else I am getting. And my dumbest purchase... I got rubber duckies. Because I've been taking baths lately and I am forever happy about stupid little bath stuff and they're 
cute. It's a mama and two little babies. Quack, 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 quack. I'm losing my damn mind. I know I am. Because I know at some point today, I have to do three loads of laundry and grade... Let's see. There's four different papers that I had my kids turned in. There's 160 of them. What's 160 times four plus whatever project grade they're doing? And I also have to write classroom expectations. And then it's parent-teacher conference week, which means a 12-hour day for me. And I'm not ready. I'm not ready at all.